Hello everybody and welcome back to RimWorld, the Atomic Robo Hotel. So in the last episode we are continuing working on all of the new area that we're working up in the top corner for, I guess, lower wealth, smaller rooms for all of our guests. And we also got ourselves a new bot. We have Poss, who is a miner. Um, along with that, uh, we got some stuff from last episode, I guess the last couple episodes. Um, this is on roof for some reason. Uh, we have two missing tiles. I look here, I don't really see anything that's useful there, uh, because there's multiple colors, but nothing indicates, from what I see anyway, that we're missing anything. Uh, so we're just gonna go ahead and build a roof zone over this whole thing, and they should fix themselves. I'm not sure where the leak is, but whatever. I'm not sure how long it's been like that either, but probably a while. Does any of this deteriorate? Nope. Okay, good. Um, along with that, what else do we got? Um, this sink. I uh, moved the sink from the kitchen to here instead of building a copy by accident, so I got that fixed. Um, uh, that came in ugly. It's fine. Don't look at it. What else was there? There was one more. Oh, uh, guest cell areas. So there's been quite a few comments over the last couple days on, uh, you know, I got to fix the guest cell area because I haven't done it for a long time. That's because last time we did it, we set it up so we never have to do it again. Uh, because if we go to our guest cell area, uh, it is the entirety of the map, every single spot. Uh, and the way that we limited what was getting sold and what's not getting sold is basically uh, anything that ends up out here that guests can get to, it's worth selling. We don't really have a reason to keep anything non-sellable out here. Uh, and then everything that we don't want to sell is locked behind fences that they can't get in, so they can't buy it anyway. Unless they accidentally get in, then they have a chance to buy it, but it wouldn't be enough to be an issue. Uh, so I did that so we never had to do guest cell areas again because I'm terrible at remembering that. Uh, we also need to get a couple pieces of furniture in here. Uh, so let's allow that. Um, I was told I should still be using uh, Quality Builder uh, because it'll make our best constructor do the building. Uh, I don't really know how I feel about that. We can actually do a different way because the problem I have with Quality Builder is that if you don't end up with the best quality, then it gets destroyed for the quality you want. Um, what we could do though, what we could do is if we say grab our constructor, uh, so we have a doggy who is 19, uh, dragon, an evil Monty, dark light. So we could say all four of these people are going to be building pretty much top quality shit. Uh, so we got, remember these, dog, dragon, Monty, dark light, dog, dragon, Monty, dark light. Dragon, dog, Monty, dark light. So if we allow these four people in here, then they'll only do the construction for us. So we don't have to fuck around with any quality builder stuff. <clears throat> so that should work out pretty good. Uh, we're also working on this area up here. We don't need to worry about that. It is going to feel eerily peaceful compared to everything I've done over the past since I started re uh, since the last episode's recording session uh, because I have been playing an absolute fuck ton of Rim City Survival. Sadly, uh, posting those videos kind of killed this series because we dropped from about 2,000 views a video to like 1,000 views a video. Um, so I kind of killed this. <laughs> Not exactly was the plan. But, yeah, either way, I've been playing an absolute ton of Sims, uh, sorry, not SimCity, RimCity Survival. And, uh, I'm so used to it, everything being so tense all the time. Uh, so it's gonna be weird. It's gonna be weird after I'm done this. I'm gonna record some more of that. So it's gonna be weird going from peaceful for three episodes to, uh, super aggressive again. But either way, oh yeah, and I forgot to, uh, grab a bunch of this stuff to minify. So we'll just, I know... Okay, let's do it pause so it's not stuttering. I know that's more than what we need, but uh, we'll uninstall them and it'll go into stockpile uh, and then obviously get pushed into here when it's time, but at least it'll be kept full. Okay, so with that done, so you guys should be doing pretty good work on this. Uh, we have lots of builders and stuff. What's our nuclear process looking like? Uh, so that's a little over halfway to getting this stuff done. Then we have to build our new reactor, so we're gonna need room for that. Uh, so what we can do is dig out this chunk, and a doggy should be doing that, because the doggies are... Oh no, sorry, it's Peter, our constructor for in here? I think? Either way, it should get done. Uh, and we actually have to let Poss in here as well, uh, because... No, Anger is our digger. Anger's the digger, and then uh, the other... Someone up there is deconstructing that. Um, that new reactor, let's get... 
all of that area done. Now that's a 16, so we're gonna have to do this in multiple chunks. So we'll do a 16 by 12. And then we'll get some walls in for support. Even that's gonna be enough for the reactor, but I was planning for, you know, the extras that need to go on with it. Uh, so we should have anger no longer in here. Uh, we can also allow pause. Uh, so that should be through here. Yeah, because we have anger. So we can allow POS to, since POS is a, another miner and much better at it. Uh, I just don't know where in the list. It, oh, right at the bottom. I was going to say, it should be right at the bottom. It is the last pawn. And it's... Oh, it's not last one up here, but it should have still been that. And it was. Okay, so that's good. Uh, so we don't need to worry about this stuff. <clears throat> uh, we have chunks that are getting moved from way over here. That's going to take forever to get all those done. Uh, and then these are all coming in relatively quick. It'd be nice if I was smart, which I am from time to time, not all the time, but from time to time, if I was smart, I would grab myself a small shelf, stick it, and actually I would be smart, I'd grab two small shelves, uh, and then we would, oh god, I lost track of who's who, uh, dark light and spirulia are constructors, so dark light, you're hauling wood, instead of hauling it there, can you haul it here? Because we could get wood here. That way it's all nice and close. I know uh, most of the wood was already used. But we still have all the beds and furniture and all that. So it's going to take a fuck ton of wood as well. Uh, so maybe even a third one. Oh, I was also asked if I could fix grass. Yeah, let's go ahead and fix this real quick before I get anger comments again. Uh, even though most of it... Because the grass I made it so it doesn't die unless it's like 10,000 days or whatever. Uh, but it's still, we have spots that get blanked out, uh, and then there too. So we grab that, 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 and that, and I missed that, so that needs to be tall grass. Oh god, there's a lot more stuff here. Dense grass, please. Um, <clears throat> and then we also need right there. Okay, and then up here should still be mostly into play. Uh, so we're going to want to extend that. That's already done. That's done, except for that spot. And we already have zones there. Uh, and then that spot there. Okay, so that was done. Okay, so that should be good. And I'll fix that little patch of grass right there. Oh, God. Where was? There's our wood. Uh, dark light. Can you... We're out of wood? Huh. Okay. Uh, we can get rid of this grow zone. Um... So if we're out of wood, are we not managing it? Forestry, yes, we are. Do we not have a woodcutter? We should. It should be all of our plant growers. Is there literally no wood left that we can harvest on the map? No, there is. Oh god, that's almost destroyed though. Um, is it that the last time we did that 12 hours ago? Uh, what am I looking for? Manager. Um, is it that 12 hours ago when we did it? I can't even do that. Uh, it was... Okay, that's fine. Uh, was it... Sorry, I keep getting distracted. Was it 12 hours ago when we did it, we had enough wood where you didn't need to do it? Possibly? Uh, what we can do is... Check this. Yeah, it's just been going down. We did a little bit of a harvest here, but that's it. <clears throat> and only a little bit designated right there. So we haven't designated anything for a long time. Uh, we're well below the limit. So, Ryan still does it. So, Ryan, what's what's going on? Why can't we uh, manage? It's because, oh, I know why. It's because technically we're not at time yet. Uh, what we can do is set that to every hour. So, Ryan can go do this. And that should go and select a bunch of wood. Should be in the keyword. We're also doing pretty good for cash now. Wow, we're up three grand from this episode. That's wonderful to see, because we could really use the cash. Okay, can you get that done, please? And did that select any wood? No. Um, okay, so what do we have fucked up? Because that was working fine for a long time. I want to say that I probably screwed up a rule or something. Uh, so we have that check target is reachable. It's always reachable. Count all on map. Uh, we have 500. We're definitely under 500. We'll limit... <clears throat> sorry. We'll get this up to... Oh, I'm fucking stupid. We turned off all the types of wood. 
So we want oak, <clears throat> poplar, uh, that makes maple wood, I think. That'd be cherry wood. Uh, shit. I don't know. Yeah, no usable wood. What's that? <clears throat> I want to say, if they don't say what type of wood it is, then it should be normal. Because that would be iron wood. That's our ebony. That's our cherry. And then red maple, I don't think is anything. So we'll allow that. Uh, and then, Ryan, I need you to go do that again, if at all possible. Um, oh, that's... Okay, that's the other tree. And I was stupid. Um, we actually did have it all set up correctly. Although, apparently, there's a but There wouldn't be a bunch around. Oh, wait. Okay, th there is trees here. Okay, so why can someone do this? Why is it difficult? Um, plant cut. We have anvil. So we do we have groy? Oh, well, you should be doing it. Dayton. What are you up to? Sewing area. Right here. Oh, okay. But then why would you be sewing instead of cutting? What's... Oh, Al Bundy's out here. But why would you not cut first when it's your job? Either way, here's the wood we're looking for. <laughs> Just had to be difficult. Um, luckily, that can also get uh, hauled in directly to up here. So let's set that for storage, critical, clear. Uh, we're going to want that raw resources and wood should be at the bottom because it's a W. And wood. So wood should be going to here. That should get put out. <clears throat> and sadly, it's going to take one person per piece of fire. Fine, it's fine. Um, okay, so nothing else we have to do here. Are we doing digging? Yes, and we are getting reactor stuff done as well. So that's basically done, it looks like. Yeah, we have about 200 points left. Uh, we don't need that. We don't. Oh, I didn't even see that mad boomalo. I should have paid more attention. It's fine, it's fine. Uh, we're also currently working on research for hydroponics. So we can get that up and running. Because it'll make uh, life a lot easier in terms of all the million different things we got to get a little bit of. <laughs> it's not like we need a lot of anything. Just a little bit of a lot. Uh, okay, so those are good. So we can copy, paste those there. So that way wood gets put there. Um, let's make life a little bit easier. I know we really shouldn't be getting rid of all of this forest. But... Uh, at the same time, I would kind of like it to get done. Okay, Al Bundy. Um, so why is... Why is Dayton not doing it? Unloading inventory. So you're going to go drop that off. Because Dayton should be the one person out of everyone that's cutting wood. Where? Oh, I thought that was wood you are taking. Like, where the hell are you taking that to? Okay, so that's good. Yeah, that's going to help a lot. Uh, especially when it comes to furniture. Before we do all of our furniture, we can probably make sure this is stocked enough. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Um, we have a prosthesis trader. Um, don't we have a bionic for Ryan already? Or did we get that in? I think we got that in. Yeah, we got the leg in. Um, it'd be nice to buy... What? Did we... Where did we... Where did our money go? We had 9,000. We didn't buy anything. Did we? Am I stupid? So, where did 3,000 silver go? Or am I blind? And that actually was 6,000. I thought it... Oh, I don't know. Oh, I'm so confused. There it is. Okay, so... Oh, I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I was looking at steel. I'm stupid. Don't mind me. Okay, so uh, we got a trade. We can get that going. Uh, we have our bionics. Uh, this should be a trader that's going to have stuff for us. We're lacking plasteel. Ryan, you're trading... I know that that would not be a bad idea. Can you come back to here instead, please? And what are we auto-buying at this point? So we're only buying uranium. <clears throat> How much uranium are we at? Because we should be building up. We have 62... 
Uh, we have lots of gold, but it's the plasteel, so we're gonna want to auto-sell plasteel back on, so we'll probably buy their entire load plus some uranium. Or just all of their... So they must not have had uranium, because that wasn't all our cash. Either way, there's some plasteel we have to work with. Um, so what is it that we're gonna need for that? So we obviously can't build that just yet. Do we have the AI Persona Core stuff? Um, for that, we're going to need 120 of the plastic steel that we just got. We have the uranium. That's a lot of gold. And the advanced components. And we have <clears throat> quite a bit of advanced components. So we have enough to get another... Oh, that's a lie. That's a lie. Uh, because the AI Persona Core takes... It's like 25 for both. Yeah, okay. We might be able to still make it. We'll see. Uh, step complete. Okay, so our next step uh, is going to be, let's just go through here. So we have to build an advanced reactor, seven construction, build an advanced nuclear reactor core. It's highly recommended that the core be built in a shielded containment room from uh, for the protection of colonists during field transfer. Uh, so that would be, oh, we got two choices. We have X and we have V. So we can go really big if we want. We don't really have a use for all this power is the big thing. Let's go with the small one. Because the um, main reason that we need this is not for power, but for fizzle material. So... Yeah, we can, we can just go with this. So we'll add this in right here. And that's going to take plastic... <laughs> Resources we don't have. That's a pain. Uh, so we don't need that, nor do we need that, or that, or that. So we're going to get that built. That'll be that step. Uh, what's the next step after that? Uh, test. Okay. And we're going to have to set up cooling and stuff, because I doubt... We have to check this out to see what our current is at. Uh, but uh, there's no way that this is going to support another reactor, too. No way. Also, it's kind of dark right here. Can we get a, a light for the end of this hallway, please? Also, is it dark anywhere else? Um, the vault needs to get destroyed still, but it's pretty bright. You can use a light. It's a little dark in here. Although, I think it's mostly because there's so much black in there. Yeah, it's mostly a blackness issue. Uh, it's a little dark back here. But again, it's mostly just a blackness. Oh, all bedrooms are done. Cool. Okay, so um, <clears throat> what we're going to need to do is get a door on this. So we can assume this is going to go straight up. Please say this is an even number so I can get a double door. Of course, that fucks up. Let's do it. Pause. It's an even number. Good. So we can get a nice double door in. Uh, so if we grab door and door that looks centered, uh, then we can get that put there. That's not going to deteriorate. All this wood outside will, though. My god, there's a lot there. We're going to need most of this, sadly. Uh, but no one's out here to haul it. Um, that hallway also is going to be a dead end. That's a dead end. May as well not be stupid and also get doors out here. Uh, and that needs a bit of floor. That's some visitors. Okay, so um, that is floors. And that's the vertical boards that we've been using for hallways. Yeah, and that roof will go in once that's sealed. It should go in now. Actually, you know what? It might be so large that it didn't auto-roof. Yeah, no, it's it's too large and awkward. Uh, plus, it was already partly covered, so I think it just freaked out. Uh, and then, obviously, we have mountain roof-related stuff. Uh, we're going to want all of that as a roof. And the hallway, of course. Uh, we want... I know that should be roof, but it's better to be safe than sorry, since we're already kind of doing this. What's that? I can't even tell what that is. It's just dark. Uh, and right there. And none of that. No. Okay. Good. Uh, and then we need to fix this, too. Um, and we are getting coffee-related stuff done. Cool. Once we get our hydroponics, we can get all that going. Uh, so we need floors. We need slate, so we can get that in. Uh, we can continue this right to the edge. We're going to have to go into god mode 
to uh, do the right at the edge. That's not a big deal. Okay. So that's all looking good. We're getting the trees cut. Uh, what are we at for wood? I'd like for them to collect a little bit more. Never mind. It's getting done. Um, can we get someone to do this so we're not running around? Evil Monty, you are hauling wood to blue... Do you, why go all the way around? Probably because that wasn't there when you started your trip. Where are you going? Why? What's with that? Um, is it... And this is something else that I was asked to update. Is it because I have all this all fucky? Uh, so we can reset all this to normal for now. I'll uh, fix it off camera. Same with over here. Yep, that's another thing I was asked to uh, check to make sure I fixed in the last couple episodes. And I forgot, of course. Um, so we can fix that. For the most part, it should be pretty much the same. And no one's going to be using any of this as a shortcut, so that's all fine. Uh, but that would make sense, because this is adding 200 pathfinding to each tile, which uh, doesn't sound like much, but when you consider... Um, what's the best example? Soil. Soil is a... with a speed of... Uh, 87%, that is a one, no, that's a two pathfinding, because I think it's about 13% for every pathfinding you go up. If I remember correctly. Uh, which is why, actually, if we look over at tilled soil, I, I technically has a walk speed of 130%. Uh, that's because I, uh, this is a, obviously, a modified version of tilled soil that I was using. Uh, this is the one that I've been kind of dragging over and over between series, uh, and that extra speed is from the Rim Village series, or Rim Valley, or whatever the hell I called it, uh, because <laughs> people were so slow walking around the map, I made uh, soil and tilled soil quicker. forgot to change it when I uh, copied these files over. The soil's right. But yeah, so that 30%, that was uh, negative... Two pathfinding, if I remember correctly. Because negative one is 118%. Fuck, I don't remember. It's some it's some weird system. Uh, but yeah, adding 200 pathfinding makes it so they think it's so unbelievably slow it's not even worth walking on. They'll do it if they have to. They just prefer not to. But either way. Um, did we not still... Oh, I forgot to reset. Okay, so Evil Monty should still be doing a runaround. That was my mistake. I fixed the issue, I just didn't fix him. Okay, so now we have a shortcut. That's going to make life a lot easier. Uh, and we can start getting all these beds in. Uh, so, I can't do it from there. I always forget. Uh, so we're going to need, we're just going to go standard beds because uh, we're not wasting all of the components on beds. Uh, so we can do, do you want to add double beds? To some of the bigger rooms at least? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, so that's a small room. Uh, we can do that in the corner instead. Uh, that's a small room. There, there. Uh, that's a big enough room. That's a small room. That's big enough. There, you can have that in the corner. That's definitely a bit small of a room. Uh, you can have there, there. Try to make it so all the beds aren't on the same walls. Oh, it's all one square. It's terrible. We can fix it, but it's terrible. We don't have a whole lot of larger rooms that a double bed. That one we can do. That one we can do. That one we can do. Oh, all these down here are nice sizes. Uh, so that... Yeah, let's do one there as well. <clears throat> That's big enough. That's looking pretty good. Uh, so then we can grab ourselves a double. Just have a couple extra larger rooms around. So that could go in the middle. That shooting... Instantly, I felt the adrenaline just burst out of me because <laughs> because I'm so incredibly used to Rim City survival that I heard gunshot and everything just went into panic mode. Oh man, that, that game mode that I've been screwing around with, it's gonna really fuck me up. Although I have learned quite a few things and uh, it, it's good. It's good, even though I suck so bad at it. Uh, it's making so I'm learning how to do things differently, how to fight battles differently. Um, I'm still terrible at looting because I don't pay too much. I don't pay enough of attention to it, and I tend to miss little things. 
like the little things like personal shields very useful uh, and armor <laughs> Uh, okay, so that looks like we got all the bedrooms set up for beds. Uh, so next, we need some dressers. Uh, so same rules as normal. Wardrobe anywhere that we can put it vertical. And then normal dressers for everything else. Uh, so you get one. You can have one. No for you. Yeah, you can have one there. You can have one here. You can have one across there. Uh, we'll do it in the bottom there. Can't do there, can't do there. That works, that works, and that works. Uh, let's actually do that one sideways instead. Um, whoa, that's not the wardrobe. Uh, we can add that in. I, I need to fix that floor corner. Yep, I remember that. Uh, you can go in, you, you, and that's it. Um, so that's looking like all of those. I really should keep it paused while I'm doing it. That way they don't start building stuff and I forget where I'm at. Um, and we need the floors there. So that's going to be floors for... Uh, that's the Versailles. Uh, is it not Versailles? Oh, no, sorry. No, that's not. It's the herringbone. Yeah, okay. Sorry, that was my mistake. I get the two mixed up. Uh, we also have some planning related stuff hanging around okay that's good uh so next we need some normal dressers as well uh so you can have one here don't know what the hell we're gonna do down there uh, you have a dresser you have a dresser you can use one you can use one you can use one you have one there is some rooms that do have both dressers that i fucked up on not a big deal in the grand scheme of things it's just a little bit more compact whatever <clears throat> it's fine <clears throat> sorry my voice is dying again it's not cooperated over the last week or so. Uh, that room would have been big enough for a double, but whatever. So we can have that. That. I get one down here. Um, so that's looking like two items in each room, as far as I can tell. Yeah, cause that's a bed there. Okay, so that's good. Uh, next, we have our end tables. So we'll start one end. So you get a double. Now this is where I gotta not fuck up rotation and also know the difference between a double bed, or sorry, a single bed and a dresser. Yeah, because that's the dresser down on the bottom. That needs two, that needs one, that needs one, one, one. I'm a fucking idiot. Uh, let's put that there. Put that there instead. Um, and we're going to need an end table. So I can go there. There and there. We'll go back down after. That's a lot of rooms we got. Holy hell. Okay. Did I miss any? So that's looking pretty good. That needs to get fixed down to there. We got just these. You never got a dresser down here. That's why we do this. Uh, you never got it. I don't know how we missed two of these dressers. Uh, that can have a wardrobe. Um, oh, and the end tables. I was like, I knew I forgot something. Okay, so with that done... Um, next would be plants and lights and whatever else... And also heating and cooling. So we'll get a plant pot just kind of scattered around. So we'll just kind of go in, fill up some of this excess space we have sitting around. Just help make it a little bit more full. You get two plant pots because I didn't notice when I placed the first one. Um, so on that there, there, that gunfire. Jesus. Yeah, it's that uh, Rim City Survival really has me screwed up. I'm going to hear gunfire for anything, and then I'm going to start like, what the hell's happening? Uh, and then we need you. Okay, so that looks like plant pots and everything. Uh, so next, we need some lighting, uh, and hallways need a lot of lighting, uh, but we'll do bedrooms first. So that, that, okay, try to do this systematically. Door, wall, you're small enough for the door. Yeah, you, and then you. Uh, that there should be enough. 
That should be enough. That's not going to work there, so we'll put it there. Should be enough, should be enough. Okay, so that's right down to there done. So then we can do this section. Luckily, most of these uh, rooms are small enough where one light right at the door seems to work pretty well. Uh, this will not, however, so that's going to need to go on the wall. Uh, and then you, okay, yeah, so then we just have this bottom strip here. You can go opposite there. You can have one there, there, and we'll do that because it goes a little bit further there. Uh, and then you're probably going to need two. Uh, it probably should be fine. Uh, and then we also need one outside each door. <clears throat> I'd like to put them on the same tile, uh, but if I do that, it'll end up deleting one, which I'd rather not have. That's a, not a good spot for it. Uh, then we could have a light right there as well. You don't need a light back here. You can have a light just here, just because we can. Um, <clears throat> and then... Yeah, so that's the outside. Then we need hallways. Um, so we could have a light here. Light there. So that covers that. That covers that. Uh, we need one in the hallway. So that can go there. So that's all covered. We need... <clears throat> sorry. Uh, one here... We should probably do one like here as well. Here. Here. We're probably going to want one at the end. And one here should do pretty good. Okay, that corner. That corner. I can't see anything anymore. It's not just you. Don't worry. That corner. And we could do one just back here. Uh, and that was right there should light up the rest of that. So that should be good. You guys should make quick work of that, hopefully. Um, <clears throat> and then, is there any... <clears throat> Sorry, my voice. It's It's been going. Uh, not. I could also just take a couple of days off and let it rest, but uh, I doubt it's going to happen. It's mostly, uh, I'm thinking, anyway, just allergies being terrible. Although, it could be worse. <laughs> I've, I've had other years where allergies really fucked me up. This year, if this is allergy, if it's allergies anyway, uh, we should be pretty alright. Okay, cool, Ryan, I need you to go uh, do that trade, please. Can you come and bargain? Uh, because, did we end up getting our AI Persona core done? No. So, what did we do with all that plasteel? Um, yeah, we built that. That was 50 of it. We just got here. It just finished, too. Um, and we still have quite a bit left. But we didn't build the AI Persona Core. Oh, we did. Am I blind? Oh, I'm stupid. We store it up here now. Yeah, duh. Come on, Ryan. You know this. Um, so we should have enough for another Tier 4 bot. We're 33 minutes in. Let's save... Here, we'll set it up. But we'll save that for next episode. Hopefully. Get a... Butler bot. Uh, so there's more. That's limited to 300, right? Set to 500. Hey, Ryan. Can you, uh, I know you just did it. Can you do it again? Because we might be buying up. There's. They still might have some extra. Nope. That was it. Uh, that last one was two ninety nine, so I figured that would be it. But before that, we did buy an even three hundred. They probably had like three fifty or whatever. Uh, but either way, so that's getting done. Uh, so next episode, all that will be finished, uh, and we'll start working on uh, our concierge, our entrance, uh, and we'll get all our pipes. This takes a long time to do a big build project. Shit. Um, we'll get all our pipes, our airs. Everything, conduits, you know, all that fun stuff. Um, so, for now, that is going to be it. So, thank you, everybody, for watching, and I hope you all have a great day. See ya.